Good to see you. Sorry that you have to be here, yeah. but I'm glad that I'm here to help. Robert Dixon is a pretty good talker. <laughs> it's just me and you, and you decide what you like best. This is all about you. That Not sounds me. great. Okay. And he's even better at making people he has just met yeah. feel at ease. That's what we're here for, to hang out, and we're going to have some fun, like, you know, like dress up. Good. We can put all the wigs on <laughs> we want. Almost three years ago, Robert teamed up with the American Cancer Society to offer free wigs to cancer patients. <laughs> that looks lovely. Today, it's all about Sherry Hay. So it's kind of my way of helping out. Here in downtown Troy, this is the first time Sherry's ever been to Robert's hair salon. With her stage four cancer and her chemo treatments, Sherry's lost most of her hair. I think it's wonderful what they do, and I was excited. A little apprehensive, but most exciting. How about we try something a little darker, but still a little longer? Sherry gets to choose from almost four dozen different styles. I think this is kind of cute, but we'll see. Yeah, they, they all look good on the mannequins. Two to three women with cancer stop by every week and spend upwards of an hour to find the right fit. To see them smile, just to know that, you know, that's one thing that they don't have to pay for. One thing that they don't have to worry that they're going to get a bill for. Each wig is donated and Robert volunteers to make sure every piece is perfect. Well, it makes you feel good. Almost a million bucks. God gives me the tools and he gives me the heart. And, and it makes people happy. Sherry said she got more out of this than she would have ever expected. I've been blessed. I feel great. And, um... We're going to beat it. Sherry left without wearing her wig. That's because she wanted to surprise her husband. She doesn't know it yet, but I told him we're going to celebrate. Celebrate they did. The Hayes took this picture at dinner that night, and Robert could not have been more proud. And you're going to be a ton times healthier, right? That's right. <laughs> I certainly hope we're so. Getting... I pray for that for you. James Brown, News Center 7.